Well, you've probably heard that several Springfield restaurants have closed since the first of the year. Well, here's some news for dedicated foodies. A new restaurant called Van Gogh's Eatery will open soon with a unique menu. <laughs> it's definitely the I got so much to do stage. Yeah, there's not a problem with it's, too many uh, cooks in the kitchen here. In fact, the top chef isn't even mixing ingredients yet. He's putting chairs together. I can't wait to see everyone just filling the chairs and the booths and, and, and eating the eating the food that we've been imagining. Like a work of fine art, the two Joes here have been crafting Van Gogh's unique menu for months now. Yes. Chef Joe Duncan and owner Joe Gidman are going Dutch. Big thing that we'll be doing is uh, the Dutch pancake. It's called Pentecoke. And uh, um, it's, I always tell people it's kind of like if a pancake and a pizza had a love child. My kids have been suffering eating, eating Pentecoke for, for months now, yes. The owner, Joe, used to live in the Netherlands. He's brought the wood shoes, the flag, and a touch of romance to the Ozarks. Well, the menu is inspired by people a world away. If you look closely, you'll see tributes to a local landmark. Joe's new restaurant is right across the street from the footbridge, and it's just down C Street from Joe Gidman's other place, Cafe Cusco. Every time we turn around, just every uh, new business, new restaurant, everything opening in the district is just another step in the right direction. We actually have uh, out there, we've got about 500 tulip bulbs. Besides Panacoke, they'll be making Meatball Stamp Pot, Kerry Kip, and Van Gogh's Ear in the two kitchens. And there's one more item that's fun to say if you're very careful. There's a, a sausage called Frickendellen that we'll be making here ourselves. Yeah, it's funny, you eat it with french fries. Oh, what's and the, the name of that sausage again? Frickendellen, and then you eat it with french fries and they call it Frickin' Fries, so it's kind of funny. You can tell your own Frickendellen joke soon. The two Joes here just hope everyday Joes and Janes will laugh and love the new taste in town. You know, we, we put out a good product and treat people right. It's, uh, we'll be here for 20 years. <laughs> Just be careful with your uh, yeah. frickin' Dellen jokes. In case you're wondering, Van Gogh is one of owner Joe's favorite painters. That's hence the tribute there. They plan to open just before St. Patrick's Day. Meantime, you can check out the menu online. I'll put it on ky3.com, a link to it, and put it on my Facebook page. You get in trouble trying to order. You could get in trouble <laughs> trying to order. You're right. Brandon, don't repeat what I said. Oh, why, why would I throw you under the bus? No. And then Kashkun.